be that young rapper dude Might just trap with you Coming with the thunder baby Might just clap your crew I roll out in the morning light What up guys, it's Murks And today we are playing a game called Mo- 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 I don't know, it's something weird But, uh, yeah I saw that it's on Steam Uh, I saw this YouTuber playing Skitman Does things And, uh, yeah it looks pretty cool. I don't know if you guys will like it. It's kind of weird. But yeah, let's just dive right into this. Blah! Alright, let's start this up, guys. Uh, the controls are really weird for me for some reason. I have no reason why, but it's just the arrow keys, and they've been messing with me forever. So, let's try this out. Bob, let's talk to this dude. Priest, my prayers go out to poor Julia. It's been a year since her husband has passed. She hasn't been seen all day. I imagine she is grieving. Do you mind visiting her at home? It's the house to the right as you leave town. Alright. Bob, you leave town right there, her house is right there. You couldn't just say the house right here, there's literally four houses in this whole town. And you couldn't say the one that you were within 15 feet of, you just had to say, as you leave town, the one on the right, you had to make me go on a whole treasure hunt and stuff, no. Alright. Blah, alright. Let's talk to this dude. What's good? Talk to boy, need to stay close to mama, otherwise she'll worry that we run off. This sounds like a real hillbilly <laughs> town Amish mother. Did you hear about the boy? Julia lost her son in the cave shortly after her husband died. Poor Julia. Dang, this Julia girl just been having a hard time it seems. I would never let my boys out of sight. Where are we going next? Uh, Alright, girl. Sometimes daddy lets us pat the sheep on the head. They're so soft. <gasps> okay. <laughs> She's talking about sheep. I, everyone else is talking about this chicken dying or something, and she's like, sheep. Okay. So, uh, let's check Julia's house out. Go in there. Look at the bookshelf. There was a picture on the shelf of a white husband and a young boy. I wonder where they are. Oh, a wife and a husband. I said a white husband. Racist ass myself. Alright, we got a little, one of those book things where you can touch it. It's like a secret wall or something. Ah, <laughs> no one's in here. Uh, a lamp. This this bed's just painted on the wall, it seems. But you know that's cool. That's cool. All right, what do we got here? Read signpost. Two is a farm. All right. And let's, let's go to the other cabin real quick. How you doing, girl? My uncle and dad are out chopping wood to keep us warm in the winter. They should be home soon. All right. Um. Anything else painted on beds? You guys must sleep well. All right. I like how I just play a guy that bursts into everyone's house. Zero F's a given. Just like, what's up, guys? If they could be like, you know, uh, having sexual relations. And my guy's like, hey, how you guys doing? Talk to this dude. I heard there's a gold in the cave, but I'm too scared to enter. They say there's a little boy that haunts over your shoulder. Hell no, nah, I ain't going to that cave. Bop. All these houses look the same once again. Uh, one left. All these houses look like something you'd make on Minecraft. <laughs> Alright, let's talk to this big dude. It looks like you haven't been outside in years. Dude, look at your skin. Why the hell? It looks like a lovely day outside. You should head out to the farm if you get a chance. Spend some time with the animals. Dude, you need to go out to the farm. Like, you need to get some sunshine. Like, you look like that dude off uh, The Hobbit. That golem dude. Like, my precious. Yeah, that guy. Talk to Chef. Alright. Let's see if there's anything behind here, like freaking secret gym looking thing. Did you hear my mixtape in the background too? Like, that, that thing's fire. Alright, nothing back there. And we go to the farm. Blah! Uh, let's see what we got going on here. Farm. Alright. Let's see, you got them sheep those girls were talking about. Let's see. I, how you doing? Uh, bad. What are you talking about, bad? I mean, uh, I I was number one. I, I took first place in the sheep petting competition last year, and I don't know I, that girl might have been bluffing. These sheep aren't that soft. They're not. They're not like hurting my hand, but they're not that soft. <laughs> Got this barn over here. The door is locked. I want it in there. All right, we're good. Here, vandal 
buy some sheep milk. Uh, Alright. To the freaking cave. The one thing I didn't want to go to. Pick up lantern. Picked up lantern. Oh, look at that hand. We're white. My brother and I were chopping wood when we heard moans coming from the cave. Oh, hell no. I ain't going out in that cave. My brother went to investigate. He should have been back heck by now. I'm worried. Can you check on him? There's a lantern behind you that's on that stump. First of all, I'd pick up the lantern. You're a little late, my dude. Second of all, no. See ya. Hell no. Damn. Alright, guys. So it looks like we're going to have to do this. Uh, oh, man. Oh, man. Nope. No. Go back in there. Alright. Hey, you. Come over here. Alright. Did my brother send you? Bless him. That means I'm coming from further down. I go... The moans are coming from further down. I go with myself, but there's my sight's no good. You should take this knife. Who knows what you may need it. Dude, the entrance is right over here. Right there, yeah. You couldn't go more than... You couldn't go 30 feet to the entrance and just get this lantern. You are lazy as fuck. I should hurt you. Go ahead, I can't see you. I need to stab you. What a stab button. Alright, what do we got here? Is that a mouse? I can't look down. Alright, I can't kill a mouse. Uh, oh no. Oh no. Alright. Let's go this way, I guess. Dead end? No. Still going? Uh, look at bones. Someone must have died here. Bones look as they are. A child's hope. Ha! <laughs> nope. Look at the hole. I can see something shiny. It's just out of my reach. Dang it. Okay, so that's the dead boy out there. And, and that is Miguel. Miguel. So. Out of your reach, just find a stick. <laughs> uh, go this way, I guess, and we'll go straight. Anything? Let's go. Anything? Bah! This is terrifying. Like, it's not that scary, but like in real life, no, I would. You're screwed. I wouldn't be going looking for her. Another mouse? Dude, this is the longest. This guy must have been in jail for so long. Uh, alright. What we got here? Look at tools. There are some tools leaning against the wall. It looks like as though they've been used to mark the cravings on the carvings on the wall. Alright. There is a book on top of this pedestal. No, thank you, Captain Obvious. It's labeled Farmers. There was a list of names inside. Wendy, Semi, Rider. You know these guys? Or you implying that they're farmers? Vesselin. How eerie. Alright, so people have died down here. Nope, not my cup of tea. I'll see you guys later. <laughs> Alright, let's uh looks like we're going. Whoa, do you got I saw Is that something? I'm stupid. Alright, looks like we're going straight now. Uh Get out of here. I'm gonna get lost. Okay, here we go. Ooh. Whoa. No. I can't be doing this. Did you hear that? I'm terrified. I don't want to do this. Why couldn't that farmer come with me? I mean, this, this lamp's too good for two. No. No, mouse. Mouse. A farmer approaches. Okay, we're good. Okay, freak me out. Let's see, all I can ask questions. I hear moans. What have you done? Why do you have a knife? Why do you have blood on your overalls? I heard moans. What have you done? Nothing. I refused to Julia's requirement in trying to get out of, in trying to get out for some help. Uh, why do you have a knife? Same to you, you know. Alright, touche. 
Why do you have blood in your overalls? I killed a sheep, but I didn't touch Julia. Oh, I'm a dude. I, I hear lies all over your face. Ooh, let them pass or attack. Uh, this, is, this is a difficult one right here, guys. You know what? You're looking suspicious. Attack that dude. Yeah. Fuck the police. No, I'm just kidding. There's a name on the farmer's overalls. Trust. I killed a dude named Trust? First of all, who named their freaking kid Trust? Uh. Another mouse. How you doing, dude? I got blood on my knife now. No. I'm hearing stuff. I'm hearing ghosts, like whispers. Oh my lord. I didn't know this game would be so scary from what I've seen. my life. My name is Julie and I want to see my child and husband in heaven. So that was good. I killed that dude. He tried to kill you, I'm, I'm guessing. He found a golden nugget. I thought we could retire and become comfortable for the rest of our lives, but he didn't trust me. He buried the golden nugget to spite me, then he disappeared. Everyone in the town heard about my good fortune. They thought I was rich. I was so ashamed that I couldn't tell them the truth. One day my son wandered into the cave. He wanted to find his daddy. Daddy, no. He wanted to make everything better, but he never came out of the cave. I went to look for him, but I couldn't find him. That was too late. Now I have nobody. Will you help me? Will you help me end my life? Well, that's not what I was thinking when I said help you end your life. You've done it before. It should be the easier the second time. Just because I got blood on my knife, you're thinking I killed somebody? You're a bitch. You know that I should kill you. But no. Since you want to die, and you're assuming I killed somebody, even though I did. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to get help. Then leave me, you coward. Bitch. <laughs> Alright, there's nothing in here. Left. Let's go over here. Yeah, we already know where everything is, so we can just leave. So, dude, alright. <laughs> Wait, maybe some freaky stuff happened. Nope. Same, his name's Trust. Was that supposed to, was that supposed to, <clears throat> trust him? Oh, Lord, what do you do? A farmer approaches. Why do you have blood in your overalls? Well, see... How did I get blood on my overalls? First of all, it was cut. Alright, I could type something sweet. Uh, shit. Hit the fan. Dot, dot, dot. Why do you have a knife? My dude. Dot, dot, dot. Shit. Hit. All one word. The... Fan! Exclamation mark. I heard moans. What have you done? That is where the story shall end. At least for now. <laughs> Alright, it is up for the next player of this game to choose your fate, just as you chose for the previous player. So, you know my first name. So, the, the farmer I was just talking to is going to decide my fate like I did to that one guy that I killed. <laughs> Alright. So, uh, yeah, you know, my dude... If you're if you're watching this right now, come on. I got I make some amazing cookies. And I'm, come on, don't don't kill me, please, please. <laughs> yeah, I wonder if there's like a set you can keep playing if uh they let you live. Nick, nah, I put my Murricks 
eats lettuce. My email. No, I'm just kidding. Bob, all right. You will be emailed about your fate. Thank you for playing. Press space to submit your details. That's that's dope. I'm not gonna lie. They get to choose your fate. All right. Don't know what just happened, but uh, yeah. It looks like that's gonna be the end for us today, guys. Uh, yeah, a little something different today. It was on Steam, so if you want to play that, I might have. The, I'm probably gonna have the link in the description. Uh, yeah, hope you liked it. And uh, yeah, <laughs> until next time. Rape your cats, do your drugs, stay in milk, and like always, eat that lettuce. I am Merrick, signing off until next time. Blah! Let me lick your cow. Blah!